the building basically started with, if we're going to be operational net zero, how are we going to generate the energy? The only feasible option was to put on solar photovoltaic panels. The next part of it was all the component pieces that were added in behind it. And all the pumping and pumping systems are all as energy efficient as we could literally buy anywhere in the world. Aquarize was chosen for a number of key reasons. Number one, it's low heat loss, heat gain, that's inherent to that piping design. Number two, it's cost and ease of putting it together and installing it in a building. Number three, it's low fouling rate because it's plastic material, unlike steel for instance, it has less probability of fouling. And because this is such a high energy efficiency design, fouling was a concern. In this particular case, the difference between putting steel for instance, or copper product together versus aqua rice is day and night. We anticipate that it'll be here many, 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 many years into the future. Whereas we know that steel piping has a lifespan and when it degrades, it usually takes all kinds of other things out with it. This project is based around choosing technologies and products that enhance the energy efficiency and design of the building. If you're gonna build your own building, build it the way you would want to build something for your client, and Acarize was our number one choice.